Hey, what's up everyone? Uh, I'm out here today starting my morning in Potter County on the first fork of Cinema Honing back in the catch and release section that I fish, fished a few weeks ago. Uh, check those videos out if you haven't. It's raining a little bit, but not bad, but it's pretty cold. It's only about 645. Uh, not sure what the temperature is, but it's below 50. Uh, I'm surprised there are quite a few cars at the first spot I wanted to go to already this morning. I expect it to just be a busy weekend, be packed. So I'm hoping here early this morning I can get a little bit of water to myself and hopefully get on some fish. Uh, hope you guys enjoy it. Don't forget to like and subscribe. It's just bound to be an action-packed weekend. So thank you guys for watching. All right, this is my first time nymphing in a few trips. First time fishing for sock trout in a few weeks. Um, no better way to, to start it out than with a squirmy wormy. We'll see how it goes. Squirmy wormy killed them here last time, but they've been in the water a little bit now. They might have smartened up. We'll see. Fish with this for a little while and then we'll start mixing it up. There we go, didn't take too long. Didn't take too long. Not sure what it is. Looks like it's on the squirmy though. It's like a rainbow trout. The exact reason we put the squirmy on is because the rainbow trout love them. And I know there's usually a bunch of rainbows in here. So there we go, first fish of the Potter County trip. Barba sooks out of him already. He's flipping out here a little bit, but nice, decent fish there. Fish on, fish on. This is like a half decent one. He made a decent run right away anyway. I haven't really got a look at him yet. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. He's kind of staying on the bottom. Another rainbow. That's about the same size as the other one. It's real pretty, though. Got a real pink stripe on him. Another squirmy eater. Can't stop the squirmy. There he is. There's the fish. Oh, on the Frenchie. <laughs> Jumping rainbow. First Frenchie eater and the first jumper of the day. Half decent fish, too. I wonder if the Frenchie has it, or the, I think the Squirmy snagged it in the tail now too. And that's why it's impossible to reel in, or to pull in. Yeah, that's what happened. Oh, these are nice fish though. Come on. Bigger than the first two, for sure. I think the hook's out of them already. I'm not certain though. It is. It's got me all tangled up, but yeah, chunky fish. Ought to be another fish hanging out in here. Yep, there he is. Bet there'll be more than that too. Got some fight in them for sure. Oh, 
Oh, oh, making a run for it. All the way back to where we started. Okay. Okay. He's got to be the same thing as the other one, maybe. Unless he's just bigger than I think. I thought I saw just a decent fish, but... Sometimes with two flies, they end up getting snagged and swimming sideways. And... Ah, he's a pretty good fish, though. Definitely. Oh, he's got to be snagged, though. He's way down there. They don't do that when they're hooked normally. We'll see. Hopefully we can catch him. I mean, he's way down there. Got to get him out of that current. They're just going to keep washing away. Trying to pull them over here into the slack water. That's a, that's a pretty good lunker right there. want to lose him now. He's not snagged and he's on the squirmy so he wasn't snagged at all. He was just fighting. Come on. Dang. Man. He doesn't have a quit in him. God, he's massive, guys. Absolutely massive. <laughs> okay, the hooks out of him. I'd like to get a picture of this fella. <laughs> uh, I didn't. Didn't get a measurement on him, but. I'd say he was 18 inches. Hey, there we got one. <clears throat> Another rainbow. Not sure what he took just yet. He took the green mop fly. I knew there had to be more than those two fish in there and it wouldn't take the squirmy anymore, so I gave him a mop. Ooh, I think I had two on there for a second. I think one got off. Nice rainbow on the Frenchie. A little fella, he's got some good color to him though. He's pretty, real pretty. Everyone just slurped a bug. I don't know what they're slurping though. It looks like a pretty decent fish. Oh, we got him. <laughs> first cast, first cast. I put a green drake on because I knew there were drakes at camp last night. I haven't seen any on the water today, but I saw that fish slurp a couple times. Oh, he tore me off. Son of a gun. <sighs> oh, the 
Golden took the draw and I missed them. Unbelievable. I don't think he'll come back for it either. Oh man. All right, so we went, went back for breakfast, chilled out around camp for a little bit. And now I'm back out with my uh, dad and my brother-in-law. Hopefully we can get them on a couple fish. I see a couple bugs on the water here. Uh, maybe we'll get into some dries at some point. Can't hear you. There's a fish. Nice fish, nice fish. Not quite as big as some that I had on earlier, but he's a good one. <clears throat> Looks to be about 14, 15 inches anyway. Oh, a jumper. All right, buddy. Calm down and come in now. Oh, that's a good fish. That's a good 15 incher. Hey, Clark. Beautiful rainbow. Not the one I wanted, but the one I got. Hey. Pop off of there, buddy. Pop off of there. That was a trophy trout in this Keystone Select stream. This one I like that one. Oh yeah, look at this. I just wonder like that one I had on how many times that took it and took it. So that's the one that jumped, I think. No, I caught it right in here. The one that jumped was out farther. It's a decent fish. I think, yeah. It almost looked like a brookie for a minute, but. You have a red on, don't you? Yeah. There's a gold, I think there's a golden out there. Clark, go get that one that just jumped. Oh, uh, I think it's on the squirmy. He ain't really coming in here. Yeah, he's on the squirmy. That's another nice fish. Oh. He's unhooked and he is free already. Didn't get to show him. There we got a lunker. On the France fly. Little rainbow, quick release on him. There's a rainbow. Also on the France fly. Two in a row for the France fly. The fly I have never fished really before today. Decent little fish. Ah, oh, come on, buddy. Tangled. Ah, he broke my fly off. Got away with it. Now I gotta retie. Looks like Brad got one. And Clark is trying to net it. We got him. Nice brown.
Did you? Yeah. Nice. That's a big one. Got a dry eater, little fella. Looks like a little rainbow. No, it's a little brown. A little brown action. Quick release, right there in front of me. Nice. Does he have my fly in his mouth? One finally ate my dry fly. It's a brownie. Probably the same one I caught earlier. <laughs> Yes, a little feller. Thank you. Offer eater and he just snapped me off. No, he didn't. He got off. Good. Whew. Thought I saw my fly leaving with him. A brookie. Do we think he's a native? I'd say he is, indeed, a native brook trout. He freaking inhaled it. That wasn't even the one I was casting to. It's another brown. Yeah, let me, I'll put 5X stippet on for you. See if that makes any difference. Brownie. Let me put 5X on for you, Clark. I guess I gave you the wrong fly, Clark. I gave you the wrong fly, Clark. That's how you get him off of there. There he is. That's the good one. My fly actually sank. He took it subsurface. It wasn't, the fly wasn't even floating. A sulfur. Oh, that's a brown, I think. Is it a brown? Yeah.
That's the one I was after now. No, I could see this nice one rising down here. That's the one I was after. That's a nice fish. Yeah, it was funny. I was about to recast as my fly sank. <laughs> and I just saw, I could see that yellow part that you said about. You can grab that. Maybe he needed to sink. It wasn't even floating at all. That was total subsurface. Looks like he's got a nice stripe on him. Basically. <laughs> Pretty fish. So I'm back here at the beaver tree. I'm not sure if they've made much progress or not. I'll have to look at the video from the last time I was at Potter County. Uh, but they had just started on this tree. The chippings were really fresh, but they don't look as fresh this time. But they got a nice chunk out of that side of it. Working some up here. But man, that's a big tree. Definitely want to keep watching this and see if see if it ends up coming down or not. Uh, yeah, there's so many bugs. You think they'd be eating more? <laughs> I have all the real bugs and you took mine. What? <laughs> all the real bugs on the water and you picked my fake one, buddy. That doesn't even look like the ones on the water. Clark, that one was right behind you. What? That one rose right behind you. Yeah. Hey, you got a little white swords on my line. There you go. Keep your rod down. Here, hold this. Hold this. Keep your rod, no, keep side pressure. Don't lift your rod straight up. Keep it tight, keep it tight, keep it tight. Is this one hanging here from here? Yeah. Okay, it's hanging in my rod. You want me to go out there for him? Or yeah. You gonna bring him into me? Bring him into me. Oh god damn it! Did he snap? I think he snapped. Yep. Ha <laughs> ha. Finally a taker here this, uh, this evening. A couple fish rising yet, but not many. But nice little rainbow. Alright, bud. Alright. It's alright. Relax, relax, relax. There we got one. There we got one hooked. About time. What do we got here? A little brownie.
There we go. There we go. Oh, feels like a good one. Unless he's snagged, he's pulling pretty good. Didn't look all that big on the hooks. But he's fighting. He's trying to stay towards the bottom. Maybe a nice brown? Maybe, maybe. I always say they fight harder on the dry. He's putting up a fight. Come on, bud. Come on, bud. Come on. He has not come off the bottom yet. Hard to believe. He's been on here for quite some time. I really can't even tell what it is. Looks like a nice brown. Oh yeah, real nice brownie. That is a wild brown, I believe. Wild or holdover, at the very least. Right in the top lip, right where you want it. It's a nice fish. He's chunky fella, he's been eating good. For sure, nice fish. We got him. We got him. Got a little brown. They're a little guy, but that's okay. We take them all. All right, guys, so I'm gonna keep fishing here, but uh, it's at the point where the GoPro ain't gonna be picking much up, so I'm gonna turn it off and just fish. Uh, it was a pretty good day. Day one was absolute success. Still don't know how many fish I caught, probably 20-ish or so, I don't know. I never count. But uh, hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and take a look at the rest of the footage from this weekend. I'm sure tomorrow is gonna be a great day, and Monday morning as well, so hopefully we can get another vid out. Uh, take care, guys.